Tributes have been paid to a 69-year-old yachtsman who died after his boat capsized during a freak storm at the weekend. Frank White from Forres was brought ashore but was pronounced dead at the scene. Emma Murray reports. A Coast Guard helicopter hovers above Findhorn Bay after calm turned to chaos when a violent squall swept the Murray Firth. A yacht race had been taking place, but as winds gusting up to 65 miles an hour slammed into the flotilla, seven boats overturned, throwing their crew into the water. Well, I was just putting up uh, the, the sails because there was no wind, so I was actually increasing sail just as, just as I was out in the bay, and then suddenly the wind came from a different direction and, and blew my boat over, and I capsized. And I was just in the bay here, so... I couldn't, I couldn't ride the boat because it was, uh, the waves were, uh, I mean, this was like a mill pond and then and two minutes later there were just big five, six foot waves on the bay and I, so I was, every time I tried to ride the boat, it just got, uh, it, I just got blown in again, the waves knocked the boat over. So in the end I just I got into the side. Experienced sailor Frank White from Forres had also fallen overboard from his 20 foot yacht. Efforts to revive him were in vain. The weather took an unbelievable turn for the worst where we had thunder and lightning rain, hail and wind speeds reading 57 knots. Born in Findhorn, Frank was an active sailor and a boat builder in the community, launching this vessel named Jopper last year. His childhood friend, Donald Watson, helped recover his friend's boat. He was a very experienced sailor and he had a, a great knowledge of the Firth. Um, he was a very jovial character, he was a boat builder, um, very talented. Um, he's going to be very, very sadly missed. He's well known all around the Murray Firth. A report on Saturday's tragedy will be submitted to the Procurator Fiscal. As you can see, the weather here in Findhorn Bay is absolutely beautiful and calm, much like it was on Saturday afternoon. That is, until the freak storm struck, causing chaos on the Murray Firth for about 10 minutes and leading to Frank's tragic death. He'll be much missed in the Findhorn community. He taught sailing here for many years and loved being out on the open water. Many here today have talked of his kindness and willing to help anyone interested in his passion, sailing. Emma, thanks for that.